Namaste, friends and peace warriors. Good day to you. I hope you're doing well. Um, I usually get uh, messages to share with you in the morning, uh, but this evening I got a message to share with you, so I've got a word um, and a uh, download from the guides and angels that I'm going to give to you now. So I hope you are doing well. It is beautiful here at Milo Farm. It is beautiful in spirit, though it's cold and dry and oh, cold and wet, actually, and uh, cloudy and cool, like fall has um, arrived. It's lovely. Um, every change is lovely because uh, um, it's something different, right? So uh, I want to tell you about the download that the guys and angels gave me today. Uh, the word they gave me was control. And they gave it to me in the middle of my work day today. <laughs> and I was trying to control what I was doing. So uh, that was funny. I had to stop and think, oh, okay. So they're trying to release me from control. Um, give me some, give me a break in the middle of my day. And that's exactly the message that they're, they're handing over is uh, that we too much try to control our lives. We too much try to figure things out. We, we go through uh, um, processes in our head and, and the shoulds and the coulds and the uh, could nots and the to do's and the don't do's uh, too often where um, their message is that the control is holding us back. So even though we think control is helping us, the control is is controlling us is what they're saying the control us trying to control is controlling us so they showed me an image of um like two islands right and uh we want to go to this other island and we don't know exactly what it is we don't know if it's rocky or it's it's uh full of forests <laughs> it's big or if it's small, if it has beaches all around it, but, uh, our, our image of where we want to go, they first off want us to release on like where we think we should go. Like I do want to go to the Island. that has got all the palm trees and the beautiful beaches and all of that. Um, <clears throat> so spirit might have a better idea where we should be going. Our higher self has, uh, has our plant life plan, in mind so first releasing like where that should be and even that if that's like where we should turn in it on a day or what decision we should make or big decisions in our life like what fork in the road which which fork should I go or which career should I do and all of that so it could be bigger little things that they're they're um, talking about when the word they talk about control so let's imagine this 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 whatever we uh, um, want to think or wondering if we should do and it's the, so it's that island right so they're saying just like let go of like how know that this is our inspiration of where we want to be but let go of how we're going to get there so if we let it unfold in front of us so let you know let life build a bridge let life bring us a helicopter to take us there let life bring us a little sail ship, a, a sailboat that's, you know, it's, it's going to be beautiful sail across the channel or a big yacht or just a swim, you know, a, a day's swim across to the next, to ne to next island. So not only releasing the control of what we think we should have, but releasing how we're going to get there. So there, there is freedom in letting go of control is their message. Uh, and <laughs> the sky is falling. Um, that is a, I've got 45 records all over my ceiling here and you can't see from your angle. Um, it's actually pretty cool. Uh, just in the middle part, I should do the whole ceiling. Um, I have a, a special story about 45 records. I'll tell you another time, but yeah, one just fell just then. So um, I'm releasing the control of feeling like I have to put this back right now. So I'm just going to set it down right here. Okay. <laughs> um, control. 
they see this as a constant human predicament. Uh, as always, the guides and angels are giving us guidance. So that is the guidance today. And they're saying right now that it's a special thing to think about right now um, because we've got some big changes in the world happening and the changes in the weather. So um, the, the release of feeling like that is going to be an issue. Um, and uh, it's kind of like let go and let God, right? Um, more of that. They want us to, to consider more of that. All right, so Milo Farm Oracle Cards. I am going to pick one and see what else they have to say about control for us today. What it has to do with. Mm, okay, I'm talking in my ear right now. Sometimes people think I'm talking to myself, but uh, I'm listening to something. This card is popping up. All right, inner strength. This is the gnome home. This is one of the, uh, it's a cedar forest. We have uh, um, our gnomes that live there and people have been starting to bring these little mini gnomes and putting them along the trails in the gnome home. So like it's a fun thing to go down some of those trails and see the gnomes in, in the trees and on the ground and in the moss and all right. Inner strength, and the, the number is uh, 28, put those together, numerology is one, um, the one. So, yeah, it, the inner strength of, so what they're showing is, is <laughs> it's funny, they're showing me, um, I'm trying to like, okay, so you if you forgot like soap in a bottle, or like, okay, you know honey is a honey bear, or soap in a bottle that's like shaped like um, a bunny rabbit or something like that. And you use it, you use it up, you know, and you use the honey up, right? I'm pouring them out right now. My imaginary bottles of, of uh, a ba honey bear and of like bunny soap. So, and now they're just like an empty vessel. Like they're just like the plastic that's surrounding them. That's what they're, they're wanting us to be is just like to empty that control, like empty the gooey stickiness out of us and fill it with just air and pleasant and calm and like um, contentment. Um, so like releasing that and feeling like we need to fill ourselves up with soap and honey uh, and, and know, and know when your vessel is clear like that, that's when the purest honey will come in and you will be guided to where to fill yourself up. Um, that there's inner strength in, uh, in the no control and letting go. And that uh, the one is not to have to rely on anything or anybody else. We like, we are the most important thing in our life and knowing that if you release what you have or your worries that that will be very helpful and also to know that um, you don't need to go outward sometimes to um, find the answers so uh, I, they, okay they said they said I need to pick a rune all right <laughs> A friend made me these runes from the cedar tree limbs here on Milo Farm. Let's see what, and I, I, I will only read them intuitively. I don't know exactly the meaning of them. Um, my friend runes Johnny knows the exact meaning of them. Oh, of course. So this is an arrow up and this is showing me. So this is like inner and this is like heavenly. So um, like, let, again, it's like the let go and let God and just like, um, release it up and out. So of course that, of course, of course that makes sense. The two parts, right? So don't let control control you. All right. Thank you so much for watching and listening. Um, we'll see what else the guys and angels have to say, uh, next time, uh, they are talking to me about, um, doing another video for you. All right. Well, I will put this back up on the ceiling after this is over. So I hope you are well and we'll see you next time. Namaste.